So today, man, what we're going to do is we're going to restore these nasty headlights. Uh, you want to get your bucket soap, water, uh, you go wet sand them. Uh, the, whatever you're sanding, headlights, tail lights, you want to use 1,000 and 2,000 sandpaper. You can use, if it's really bad, you can use 800 on it. But um, then after you do that, you dry them. And then what I like to use is the Ultimate Compound by uh, Meguiar's. No, I'm not doing endorsements on there. The company didn't ask me to do it. It's just a product that I used. Really, any any kind of uh, wax compound will actually truly work. Uh, and I'll show you what the headlights look at look like uh, before we start. Found a bumper today. These are tail lights. You see how dull and and uh, weathered they look. So this is my truck I got from my brother I'm restoring. I've already marked the body on all the high and low spots. But anyway, uh, these are the headlights. Got that bumper today. Found it. And uh, you see how weathered they are. And what it is is just UV, uh, what they call UV fade or uh, where the sun dries the plastic out. And uh, what we're going to do is we're going to wet sand them. The key is when you're wet sanding those uh, to make sure that you always keep this area wet. So that's what you want to do. You want to go from side to side uh, when you're wet sanding. So, but I just want you to look at them before we clean them and buff them and all that good stuff on my truck. So we'll see. Well, I'll show you. The difference here in a little bit so these are the before like i said man get you a bucket of water soak your uh sandpaper in soapy water and uh do do what you what you need to do to get them done and then be done with it so like i said uh sandpaper some kind of rubbing compound get you a bucket and some soap and uh and have at it but um, all right, man. I'll show you the uh, the end result here in a little bit. All right, y'all. No.